Carlos is the guy I'm the most nervous about of everybody. Yeah, and he's got a couple of thousand left. That is my biggest downfall. That's my Achilles heel. But this time, I got my mind right. If I get pocket kings, I'm folding right from the door. I'm feeling pretty good. Getting my mind ready. Can't get awestruck with anybody at this table, see? Being that I don't really know any of these people personally, I'm kind of figuring them out as it goes along. Like in the beginning, I'll be very, I'll be very tight with my hand. I fold. You fold. Phew. One down. I think Bill tries to play you a little bit. Like, you take, you take. And then I think once you get out there, he's gonna just pull out a knife and just slice you. With what, what to wear, what to have for lunch, uh, how to look busy when your boss walks by. Well, here's another one of those inquisitive little forks in the road of life. We're gonna hide all but one player's whole cards and ask you to decide. All right, Dave, we're playing along with Kelly Williams in the small blind, and we have Queen 10 off suit. They looked, they looked in the truck, and they're suspecting you of cheating. <laughs> Kathleen's big blind. And we're watching all the players at the table trying to pick up tells. And we're wearing a dress that is sexy without being slutty. So we're already winners. I fold. Why not? Delay folds. Delay's going to fold. I'm happy to see that. Bill folds. Carlos folds. All right, now we're in the small blind. This queen 10 is definitely playable. Okay. And I think we should play it for a raise, Dave. I will. One of the reasons to raise is to steal the blinds. The other is to get your opponent to define their hand. Raise. <laughs> Kelly's raising 300 to 500 total. So I have to put in 300. I'll stay. Why not? Mm. That's That's <laughs> Two players. The flop is Jack of Spades, King of Hearts, King of Spades. Kelly is first. Now we flopped an open-ended straight draw, Dave. We need a nine or an ace to make a straight. I'd like to bet right out here. All in. I like that. All in. All in. All in. All in. All in. I'm hearing voices. <laughs> the right bet here is about 500. But shouldn't we be nervous about two kings? What's the pot? We should be, but we've got a great draw here. Thousand. All in. <laughs> I'll raise the pot. <laughs> Sorry. Kelly bets a thousand. That's a decent bet. Okay. Uh, we're gonna find out exactly where we're at. So this if game. I want to bet, put her thousand and then raise a thousand. Minimum. Okay, we've been raised, but it's a small raise. We got a hold of my hand. <laughs> Yeah, Dave, we've got eight cards that can come on the turn that will give us what we hope will be a winner. I hope I'm doing the right thing. You are. What? Oh, what? I need to, I need to. A thousand to call. A thousand to call. I will call. That's an easy call. All right, hope for a nine or an ace. The turn is a six of clubs. Six did not mm. help our hand. Now we have two choices here. We can bet out a small amount and hope to only get called, or we can check and hope that Kathleen uh, makes a mistake with a small bet. Check. Kelly checks. Thousand. Kathleen bets a thousand. Kathleen only bets a thousand dollars. Channel Phil, can't I? <laughs> Kelly, we're getting six to one on our money, and we're four to one to make it on the river. What would Phil do? What would Jesus do? Right. <laughs> you think so? <laughs> We're going to make our hand about 20% of the time on the river. I'm going to enjoy my Manhattan. Oh, why not? <laughs> yes, good call. We're definitely getting the right pot odds to call. And here's the river. Hope for an ace or nine. It is an ace. Oh. We've made a straight. Broadway, 10 jack, queen, king, ace. One more bet before we show. All in. All in. I would bet. Oh, I wouldn't bet that much, though. That is a monster bet. I don't know why she's going all in. You really want to make a bet here that your opponent can call. Wow. Kelly bets 6,200 6, all in. Oh. Now, if Kathleen has a king in her hand, it's going to be really hard for her to fold. I hope I'm reading the way. I got to fold. Kathleen folds. Kelly well, maybe she didn't have top. a king. Let's see what Kathleen has. Oh, she did have a king. That is a fantastic lay down from Kathleen. I mean, wow. It's hard to get away from that, yeah. There are not a lot of professionals that can get away from that hand. That being said, the $1,000 bet on the turn was really a mistake. She really had to bet more on the turn to try to get Kelly off her hand. Yeah. Kelly either has her beat or she's on a draw. You have to make her pay an appropriate price to draw against you. Mm -hmm. So she should have bet at least half the pot. 
If you guys played this hand anything like Kelly did, congratulations. You also took advantage of Kathleen's mistake on the turn. Don't mess with Kelly. I'm Kelly Williams. I'm playing for Care Tsunami Relief. I grew up in Los Angeles. I guess I'm competitive mostly with myself, more than with others. You know what scares me? I'm scared. No, I fall. Betting. The blind gets bigger, and then the pot gets larger, and then I'm like, how much is in the pot? What's the pot? If I'm doing well, I think I'll be all right with it. If I'm not doing as well, I'd like, fold, fold, fold. Kelly fold. I know that Dula Hill is a good player, right? And he might be a little full of himself, but he doesn't scare me. Don't mess with Kelly. Oh, hey. I think Carlos is tired, which means I might be able to beat him. It's not about being liked. It's about winning. Kelly wins the pot. <laughs> you think I'll win? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Can Kelly hold on to her chip lead? Look at the swagger. That's because I'm drinking my wine a little bit. You should look at Kelly. That's what you need to look at. Kelly. No, that's the devil. <laughs> Who will be brave enough to play with Kelly? I will not play with the devil again. Find out if the devil gets her due when we... Welcome back to the Palms in Las Vegas. Consider that rash a souvenir. We're playing Celebrity Poker Showdown, and we've got five celebrities out there doing all they can to try and take the biggest slice of the Cadillac Bravo million dollar prize pool. <laughs> Phil, that's just hurtful. Mm. <laughs> and speaking of pie and Phil, I know you love pie. Phil, how has that pie been sliced up between our contestants? You're asking for the chip count, here you yeah. go. Kelly Williams is our chip leader with 13,200. Julie Hill is in second place with 12,000 even. Third place belongs to Carlos Bernard, who's holding steady at 10,000 even. Bill Brechtrup is in fourth place with 9,000. And Kathleen Madigan is the last comic standing at the bottom of our list. She's got 5,800 in chips. $2,200 blind. Shuffle up and deal. Kelly's got to feel good about being the chip leader. And Bill's got a jack seven. Bill Continuing folds. to play tight, Bill folds. Come on, Carlitos. Carlos. Did you say Carlitos? <laughs> Carlos, you got to look at your card. Hey, baby. <laughs> I listen to you. Pair of twos. I like uh, this hand. I'd play it. No. Oh, oh no. Folds. Kelly's got an, uh, an eight four suited. Oh. Kelly folds. Kathleen, Jack nine. I fold. Kathleen folds. Oh, Dulé wins the She's a little scared of Dulé. Oh, that doesn't feel good to me. <laughs> I don't like that. Don't just take the chips and stack them. Why are you looking at me? You should look at Kelly. That's what you need to look at. Kelly. No, that's the devel. Sean, you know who the devil really is, right? Carlos you it was is first jack. And Carlos has got ace-king suited. This is one of the best hands possible in no one that hold them. Raise. To start, he should Carlos raise it for sure. Raise, raise 600. And so he does. Carlos raises 600 to 800 total. Kelly with queen two Kelly folds. folds. So yeah. far, I like the way they're playing before the flop. Kathleen, Kathleen folding, folding King Jack. Good fold there. Nah. Eight fold. Nah. Nah. Dulé folds. Bill has four five. Bill folds. Carlos wins the pot. Good play from Carlos. That's the value of the pre-flop raise. When you raise before the flop, you get a chance to steal the blinds. And even though the blinds are 100, 200 and not very significant right now, stealing the blinds is definitely important to your strategy. Why do you, why do you say that to me like that? The only blind you've ever stolen is from the cup, from the, <laughs> yeah. from the beggar outside of yeah. New York, New York a couple weeks ago. One of these days I'm going to play this game. Big play. Blinds are 100, 200 still? No. It's inspiring. No. It's fun. It's inspiring. first pack. You'll call me when you're going to go play, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. Kelly with the jack five. Because I'm going to bring some money. All right. <laughs> Kelly, Paul. You talking to me? <laughs> you talking to me? <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> Kathleen folds Queenie. Queenie, and it was a 3-9 there for Dulé. I see. I'm trying to beat. Oh. Dulé folds. And Bill. 7-4 <laughs> off suit. And he's going to fold, and Carlos in the big blind is going to take the pot with two kings. 
That is a sick feeling when you pick up a hand that good in the big blind and no one plays with you. Mm -hmm. Three nine suited. Kathleen folds. King five for Dulé. I fold. Dulé folds. Bill two five. A poor Bill. That's the same look come that on, Anthony Bill. Perkins gives come at the on, end Bill. of Psycho. Come on, Bill. Come on, Bill. Kelly, come on. Look at Kelly, dear. Come on. I'm trying to build up my tight table image. Thank you. It's working. Mm -hmm. Bill folds. Ten five off suit. Raise, um, What's up calling Carlitos? Carlitos. 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 Carlos is going to try to steal the blinds here. Carlos raises it 600 to 800. Because from my experience, I always make the right move when I'm watching than when I'm actually playing. Carlos rolls. Kathleen, she's a comedian, right? Come on, it's all fake money. Generally speaking, I don't like funny people. Kelly Williams, just met her, she'll win. Bill plays this whole sort of timid thing like I've never played poker before. I'll check. Bill checks. Guy plays every week. Absolutely. It's all an act. He's full of it. My weak points, I couldn't tell you. I'll take anybody down. Blinds are still one in 200, Dave. Dulé is first to act. All right, and uh, Dulé Hill has an A6 soft suit. I fold. Dule folding an ace before the flop. What's world? Carlos folds. And it's a jack eight for Kelly. Can we see the flop? Kelly in the small blind. She can choose to raise or complete Let's the blind. The That's what I would do. Kelly calls. Oh. All right, let's go. Okay. And she's okay. going to check. Jacks, two players. The flop is six of clubs, jack of hearts, queen of spades. Kelly's flopped a pair of jacks. Kathleen has the best hand, Dave, with a pair of queens, and she's 82% to win. Oh, and and she mixed the metaphor and folded. I'm Kathleen Madigan, and I'm playing for the NAACP. I have four brothers and two sisters, so I was very competitive. I don't want to brag, but I was also the hoop shoe champion of mid-Missouri at age 12. I played poker my whole life. Hold them for real, like where we have to be totally serious, no wild cards, no nonsense. Um, yesterday. Kathleen wins the pot. <laughs> Easiest game. Yeah, no, I would always pass the poker room in casinos and go, who has the patience for this? And you'd hear them calling out names. Josh Mahokiho to the poker room. Welcome to America. My brother said to be patient and to not be betting on hands where I know I'm going to lose just because I'm an idiot. But if it was up to me, I would bet all my chips every single hand. I saw Bill upstairs in a makeup chair, and Bill should be very worried about the amount of man. And Carlos folded a 10-2, and it's ace jack for Kelly. Very good hand on the button here. You 300? Kelly raises it a little bit. Kelly raises 200 to 400. And Kathleen's got 9-4. I will play with the devil again. <laughs> Kathleen folds. Dulé, Jack-7 suited. And Dulé's going to call with the Jack-7 suited. It's only 200 for him to try to see the flop. Dulé, 29% to win here. The flop is six of clubs, king of hearts, seven of hearts. And now he's a lot better. He's 85% to win. He's got a pair of sevens. I'll check to the better. Kelly might be able to win this pot if she's able to make a big bet here and represent a king. Oh, Kelly okay. checks. Oh. Mm. But that's not going to do it. Turn is a ten of hearts. Dulé is first. Dulé still has the I'll best bet. hand now, 84% to win. 500. Kelly needs a queen 500. to make a straight or an ace to make a higher pair. But she doesn't have a heart in her hand, and with those three hearts on the board, it's going to be very difficult for her to play. What are y'all doing? Why y'all got to talk now? Can you got to focus on the game, please? It's a pretty easy fold, and she does fold. Dulé takes the chips. Everybody is developing their own particular strategy. My grandmother's telling you to fold. <laughs> Don't be distracted! Oh. Oh. And then the whole game switches to war. Carlos is first jack. <laughs> so Carlos, uh, jack six. <laughs> this show is eight and a half hours long. <laughs> Carlos folds. And Kelly's got a king five off suit. Come on, Kelly, look at all that money you have. Oh, yeah, Kelly folds. And it's a 5-2 there. Hold it around to Dulé in the small blind.